What is up guys? ALJB Gaming back here and yes, this is correct. You are watching me play some Skyrim here. I know I already have a Skyrim Let's Play series that went to about 30 episodes. Um, but I downloaded it again. Uh, I had that game a long time ago. And I've been playing it pretty uh, prof or extensively here. So I wanted, you know, I was like, I don't know, I'm just playing this on my own. I might as well start recording some of this. It's pretty fun. I know it's an old game, but I've been playing it so much that I thought, you know what, I might as well share the experience. And, yep, so here it is. I'm going to do a playthrough, uh, probably for quite a while. This is always a good go-to game. There's just no way you're not going to have fun with this. Such a great game, the Elder, the Elder Scrolls Skyrim. Um, so, to start off, I have tons and tons of mods here. I'll try to put them all in the uh, description so you can see them. Uh, one of them that I have that you'll notice here is the horse follower mod. So I always have a horse that I have it on call as well. If I want to call it, push the Z, do my shout, and it instantly teleports to me, and I can jump right on it, which is awesome. <laughs> I did not have that before, but now I do. Um, I'm playing a Khajiit uh, archer. Um, let's see what else I can talk about here. Uh, I got the sky UI, as you can see here. I have a bunch, <laughs> I forget the name of the mods, um, a bunch of new items. Uh, as well as a bunch of new crafting. You can craft all the set gear, all the uh, guild gear. Like, once you get into the uh, Thieves Guild, you can then craft their gear. Once you get into the Nightingale, you can then craft your, their gear and put your own custom enchantments on and stuff. So, um, that is really cool. That is really, really cool. And also, there's a smelting mod where you can break down, like, crappy fine. You can uh, take a skull, crush it down into bone powder. It's so useful stuff. So, it makes, like, the crafting much more intuitive. You can... It's free. There's no limits. There's no well, there's, there's none of those odd limits that they put on there. Like you can't do certain things. It flows a lot better with the game, I believe. So that's a brief introduction there to what I'm doing and some of the mods I got. <laughs> You'll see uh, more as we go. Um, so let's see where I am at right now. I'm doing the companion, the companions quest line. Um. I get to deliver the axe back to Jarl Ulfric, um, the, Jarl, the Jarl of Whiterun uh, sent him back. He is going to not decide with Ulfric's Stormcloak, or the Stormcloak, not the Companions, that's what I'm talking about. Um, so he's not going to lie with him, so I have to go and tell Stormcloak Ulfric that he is not going to do that. So let's go. I don't know. And here I'm going to be doing a lot of roaming too. I'm not going to stick to quest lines, per se, perfectly like I do with like uh, Far Cry 3. I'm just going to be open no matter what I'm doing. I'm just going to record it and just going to have fun. No guidelines, no rules, just playing Skyrim. I'm level 7 at the moment. This is actually the second time I bought this game. I bought it for the PS3, but once I got my new computer, I could not resist getting it with all the mods that come with the uh, PC version. Or are available to the PC version. The Empire's ravenous hunger for Skyrim silver makes them fierce. But rest assured, we'll win the reach and rest them. I was wrong about him. You're right, Dalmark. Again. I'm in no mood to joke. Give the word, my lord, and White Run is yours. So these guys won't attack White Run. Dark camps, we're ready, Ulfric. Whenever you are. Is any man ever ready to give the order that will mean the deaths of men? No, but neither is every man able to give that order when he must. But you are. You've been that man before, and you'll be him again. And these men and women, they call it reminds me a lot of um because they believe in you. The Witcher outfit, they this outfit he's wearing, this armor. Like exactly. Skyrim has to offer. And they want this. They want this as much okay, as come you on. do. Perhaps they want it more. 
You're certain we're ready. White Run's army will no doubt be bolstered with legionnaires. And those walls around White Run are old. But they still stand. We are ready. And I might be old myself, but I'll kick those damn walls down with my bare feet. If you would only ask me to do it. <laughs> I'm sure you could do it too. All right. This is it. Yes. This is progressing uh, pretty quickly here. A new day is dawning, and the sun rises over White Rock. Uh, do I got to do this? And the sons of Skyrim will greet that dawn, teeth and swords flashing. So it begins. Make haste to our cabin, White Rock. I want you on the. <laughs> I have a feeling about you. Your place is on that battlefield. I need you there. Yes, sir. Fight well or die well. Talos be with you. Speak, friend. He's expecting Damn, you. Damn, Talos. He's one of men in the rift. It's dangerous having Imperial skulking about on the southern border of East March. That was weird. Keep your brother. He'll keep you. All right, Galmar Stonefist. I need to get my orders from you. Meet the brothers gathering for the attack. All right, let's do that. Actually, I want to explore a little bit. I want to uh, do a little leveling here. I kind of want to get my levels up on my bow. I uh, have no zoom. And there's no slow-mo on it. I want to get that before I really do too much. I also have the... What's it called? Um, the eye HUD. Yep, the eye HUD. So certain things only show up when... Uh, you need them to. Like the all the health and the stamina and the magicka doesn't display until like you're actually fighting and need it as your reticle. Maybe I should do the um, Thieves Guild first. I don't know. So my follower has a, a horse as well. That's pretty cool. There's my horsey coming to me here. Hello, hello. Alright, let's go on our journey. Pretty excited excited to be playing this uh, playthrough. I was playing on my own a lot, but I was like, you know what, if I'm going to be doing this, I might as well put it on my channel. Because if I'm not doing anything else, I'm not really making any content, so I'm like, you know what, might as well. And there also is horse combat too. It's pretty cool. Um, okay. Let's uh, explore something. Let's just walk. Let's just walk. Or ride. Let's see what we get into here. Wish I could harvest those. No. There's a castle up here I might be interested in um evading. Oh whoa whoa whoa. Red guard woman. I don't have time for the warrior. Brother, I think she's telling the truth. What's going on here, bro? She doesn't have the scar. What? Oh, you're right. We've made a mistake. Move along before that mouth of yours gets you into trouble. Good morning. All right then. Ask your someone. Make Need sure something? it's the right person. Farewell. The really right. tan woman. What, a <laughs> what was all that about? They thought I was some other red guard woman. They just wouldn't leave me alone. I hope they get lost in the wilderness. Okay. Um, I do have a quest to protect some red guard woman that they are trying to find. So that actually was them. Looking for the Red Guard women I'm protecting.
Do -do 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 -do. Harvesting a bunch of stuff. Sweet ass <laughs> scenery here. All right, let's uh, storm this castle, eh? No. Shoot! 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 I know I'm here. I think. Oh, Lydia. You moron. It's probably gonna die. Oh, <laughs> no. Huh. That's interesting. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, I see. The trap. So there's a few things I want to unlock. I want to unlock uh, faster movement while I'm using the bow. Oh no, I can't get out of here. Ah, son of a gun. Alright, what's up my weapon? Come on, stop crouching. Uh, I don't know if this is good. Hope Lydia didn't die. Nope, she's good. Ba-boom. What up? Okay, I did level up. Well, let's actually see if we can bring up, take off these guys. Ice hands. Egg. Awesome. Oops. Level up, level up, level up. Um, let's do health. And let's continue with my bow. Oh, yeah. Yes! That's what I want. So now... Nope. So I can draw. Aim, baby. That's what I was looking for. That is what I was looking for. Most awesome. So the tankers, like, you can melt these down at the smelter, actually into uh, metal. It's very, very useful. Very cool, man. It, like, really, really um, brings the awesomeness of um, Skyrim out. Like, I don't know why you couldn't do that before. It's kind of weird. It's so intuitive, you know, and Skyrim's like this real-world freedom thing. You know? But you couldn't melt down things. You couldn't make certain items. You can only make certain ones. It's like there are certain items in the game that you couldn't craft and... It's just weird. It's kind of really weird on the crafting side. They kind of like didn't complete it or something. Let's go inside and cause a little ruckus. More fun scar. Alright, I got some realistic lighting here too, so it's a little darker than normal. Sneak, yes, sneak with me, sneak with me. Yes, excellent, excellent, excellent. Got the uh, better organization too. Organize these items a lot better. Yes, what got his axe? Another really cool thing is uh, the addition of items that let you carry more. Let's see here. Shoulder pad. Look, look at this. Carrying capacity increased by 75 points. So really, you can just keep adding these items onto you and it's infinite. Like, you can carry as much as you want, which is really cool. 
which does take away from the realism, but, you know, I like uh, a little convenience with my realism. It's maybe kind of uh, contradictory there, but I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> All's good. All is well. Oh, there's also wearable lanterns that I'll put on here. Let's see. I uh, latch it on my back there, and it gives me a light. Works really good with the uh, improved lighting mod, or realistic lighting. Wish I had the uh, shout that lets me see everybody through the walls. Oh, come on. Alright, there we go. I'm always afraid I'm going to smoke Lydia. Probably will, huh? She got him. No big. <laughs> Good job, Lydia. Good job, yeah. Okay. Boom. Workbench. The other one I killed. Arrow sticking out his back. Yes, excellent, excellent, excellent. Wicked. Let's take that. Look at our crafting here. Let me show you a little bit of what the extra crafting is. Auxiliary armors is one. Armored fur, barbarian gauntlets, this kind of stuff. Black hood, heroic storm cloak. So this is what Galmar stone fist wears. And before you couldn't even get access to it, but now you can craft it. Since I was in the uh, storm cloaks, once you um, get into the quest line, then it unlocks it for you. You couldn't undo this stuff before. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's see what else we got here. Yeah, this is a new uh, weapon. There's a ton of new weapons I, down I downloaded in here. The mods, for the mods. Katana. Nadachi. Bunch of cool shit. Uh, craft arrows for once. Just need uh, firewood, feathers. Pretty, uh, pretty intuitive too. It's like you actually need those uh, pieces of material to make the actual wet item. So, it actually makes a lot of sense too. So that's some of the stuff you can do. There'll be a lot more as I um, unlock different things, different quest lines and stuff. what's down in here. Feel like something's gonna be up here pretty soon. Reintroduction of the series. Oh, really excited! Really freaking excited. I've got a bad feeling about this. Hmm. She's usually right too. Yeah. We have fought art thou. We have fought art thou, enemy. I'm sure this is connected to a quest line. I'm probably screwing up. You. What are you? Who goes there? Boom. Sneak attack. <laughs> oh, 
Awesome. Funnest class by far. Oh, what's up, bro? Done. Missed. Uh, I missed. Nice. Dude. Sweet. Easy peasy. Iron shield. I can sell that. Yeah, let's sell that. Petty soldier and spell tome light. I can disenchant that. Pretty good loot. Pretty good loot session right there. Don't give a shit about none of that. Skull troll. There's troll skull. Search end table. Hmm, no. Probably could take that and melt that down as well, too. But, not too concerned about that. I did have this mod that told me which books give you skill points, and I wish I had that right now. Because I don't want to look through all these. Frontier Conquest, read that one. Nothing. Yeah, I'm not going to go through all this. Steel arrow. That's mine. Mine, 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 mine. Ooh, look at this. Let's see. Oh, wow. That's a lot, of, a lot of money. Probably just disenchant that. Adept. Oh. Nice. Sweet, let's take it all. Alright guys, I am going to call it there. I'm going to keep these kind of short. Probably really 20 minute range for each one of the uh, episodes. Probably not going to stop at major points, just like a time thing. So uh, thank you for watching the reintroduction of the Skyrim series. Pretty excited to play it. Um, I hope I play this for quite a while. I definitely will play this for quite a while. I hope you guys will watch though. So uh, thanks for watching guys. If you like the content, please subscribe. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.